Hello Facebook and thanks for watching. Got a, another deal today. Today is Saturday, um, June 16th. And uh, get this Dell laptop at the flea market today for five dollars with the official Dell charger. It is a Dell Latitude D3, uh, excuse, excuse me, a Dell Latitude D430. If Ethernet. And USBs on each side of the VGA cord. On this side, we've got some venting and the Wi Fi on off switch and the power button. And on the front side, we've got it's a combination palm wrist and battery pack. And it does have a little chip out of it. It was already busted, but it went ahead and fell and went out. There's nothing, you know, leaking out of it. All the stuff self contained in its own little stuff in there. this side we have some kind of removable something here and an SD card here it's like a little filler So it's tricky to get back in. Anyway. I'll mess with that later. And this thing was nasty when I got it. This is my cleaner of choice to clean off electronics when I get them in the flea market and this guy was gross he's all cleaned up now and that is what it is the battery on this thing is shot but we're gonna hook the power up and set you on a tripod and get back with you all right we're back and here we go we're gonna fire this thing up I've already previously fired it up uh, what it did before is it would fire up and run go through all the boot stuff get to the window screen and after windows stopped loading it would be a, just a white screen well, I thought it may be like a connectivity issue between the uh, ribbon cable and the between the, you know between this part of the computer and this part of the computer, the ribbon cable that connects it both. I thought that might be the problem with it, but it wouldn't. What it did is it had a piece of malware on it. Um, drawing a blank on the name of the malware, but it basically gives you the white screen of death. It was just a a blank white screen, and I was able to go in through system restore go back to an earlier point and was able to get into the system it did not have a password on it and was able to run malware anti-malware bots malware bots and got it all cleaned up it actually had two pieces of trojan malware on it 
and then like 20 something pieces of just other stuff but enough of me talking we hit the power button we're gonna let this thing crank up invalid configuration information I think what it is is the CMOS battery is dead so it gives this issue every time it boots up after unplugging it because the battery in it is shot and I guess the CMOS battery or whatever it is that keeps the date and time is bad so let's go ahead and set the date and time can y'all see that better now still just a tad bit at the top of the screen you can't see I apologize for that go down to date and time Today is Saturday. Today is Saturday, June 16th, 2018. And I don't have a clock handy. Eh, that's somewhere around 4 o'clock, I guess. So we'll go in the afternoon and that's this device powering up my little Motorola phone so sorry about that Speaking of how nasty this computer was, uh, you know, dirt and grime wise, <laughs> this was a sticker that was on it that I was able to peel off. Thankfully it came off and with the Mr. Clean multi-purpose cleaner I was able to not even leave a residue behind of the old sticky. This did come with Windows 7 Professional instead of Windows XP, um, like the sticker said. I may have said this already, but it is a Dell Latitude D430. It's considered an ultra portable system and it did come with office 2010 everything um, you got outlook and word and just all kinds I mean every office program on here ready to go it's still finishing booting I'm going to go ahead and see if it'll let me get down here to the start menu and pull up some computer information. The system properties. But it is running Windows 7 Professional Service Pack 1. It is an Intel Core Duo. with one gig of RAM and the hard drive is just about full it has a I believe it is a 55 gig hard drive in it and it's only got 
1.70 gigs free. One cool thing about this system is the movies that come with it. They come with movies. Pre-installed. Of course, they were probably torrented or something, but you got Man of Steel from 2013. Now You See Me. Ted. That's My Boy. The Amazing Spider-Man. And Total Recall.